Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. And on today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the new WWE Elite Series 76 Christian. I just got them on the mail today. Um, I did order them about, about two months ago and they were supposed to be released in early April. But because of uh, COVID-19, everything got pushed back and they were just released about a week ago and i did have to order them from ring side collectibles because um it's going to be a while before they hit stores um it's going to be about a month or two months from now and i have to have christian anything from the attitude era just like viscera it's going to be coming out next month so i did order it from ring side collectibles so i should be getting that early next month too but here we have the back of the box of the elite 76 Christian. So I did order two from Ringside Collectibles and both of them are the regular version. Um, hopefully when they start hitting stores in about a month or two months, um, hopefully I can find the Chase variant of Christian because he looks pretty cool with the uh, black shirt, gothic shirt. But let's go ahead and get him open. And for sure from this wave, once they hit the stores in about a month or two months, I'm definitely going to pick up John Cena. Otis and Lacey Evans and the only reason I didn't order those uh, three figures from Ringside Collectibles is because I already have a lot of stuff pre-order including Viscera that's going to be hitting next month and also all of the all elite wrestling figures are going to be coming out uh, pretty soon um, I think I should get them by early July but here we have the first piece of accessory and this is the wine glass and I don't know if you can see on here, but it has pretty good detail on it. Um, you can see uh, it looks like a dragon. So that's pretty cool. And then here we have his shades. So they're a little shorter than the ones that you uh, compared to the other uh, accessories that come with the other elite figures. But that's your standard uh, shades. And then also with one set of interchangeable hands. And let me go ahead and get the figure out. And he also comes out, uh, he comes with that necklace on his uh, neck. And I don't think the necklace is removable because of the hair that goes all the way to the back. But uh, so far, I'm really liking this figure. Um, so this is my first Christian figure from Mattel. Um, now that we already have uh, the Brute Christian and we already got Etch from the uh, SummerSlam series. Um, all we need is Gangrel. But Mattel did an amazing job on this figure. It looks just like Christian. And it seems like with time, um, they're getting better and better with the um, their elite figures compared to the first wave that they released a couple years back. But they are getting a lot better. Articulation is always great on the elite figures but we're here it looks like there's a some paint on his armpit no biggie on that but as you can see you can see his skin underneath his shirt that's a little bummer because you can actually see it depending on how you can display him you can also see it on his left arm but overall they did a really really good job with uh this Christian from the Attitude Era. Now let's go ahead and uh, put the accessories on him. So let's go ahead and try his shades. So there we go. He looks really awesome with those shades on. So now let's go ahead and put his wine glass. And I'm really, really hoping that Mattel will release a Gangrel figure, but I highly doubt it because I don't think Gangrel, he's under a legend contract with the WWE. Um, but I'm super excited with the uh, old school figures. I'm super excited that Viscera is coming out next month. And then we have uh, a couple more legends that are going to be uh, coming out like Eddie Guerrero. Um, but yes, um, super excited to see what other legend figures and another one that i'm super excited for is the uh nation of domination mark henry that's supposed to be hitting walmart's 
in mid-August. But there you go, folks. It looks really awesome. I'm super excited that I finally got it in the mail. It took about a week to get here, but um, yeah, I had to pre-order from Ringside Collectibles because there was no way that I was gonna wait about two, uh, one or two months before they start hitting stores. But yes, this figure looks awesome and hopefully I can find the Chase variant at my local Walmart or Target when they start getting him. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think about this figure. If you did pre-order from Brainside Collectibles or you're just going to hold back until they start getting them in stores. But as always, thank you so much for taking your time for watching my videos. And please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And y'all take care and I'll see you soon.